4 million women are living with cardiovascular disease currently in the United States. 90% um, of women have at least one risk factor. And when Go Right for Women started in 2004, we had women join the movement. And 90% of women who joined made at least one behavior change. So whether that was lose weight, exercise more, eat a healthier diet, or just know their numbers. Um, so that's what it's all about, is um, empowering women to improve their health. I am the chair of the Kentucky Anna Go Red for Women. Um, we go out during um, events and to the community and we educate about um, women's diseases, things that might affect them, provide them with the resources within the community. We are involved in our Go Red for Women luncheon as well as the walks. There's many different um, health activities that we do. Uh, signs and symptoms can vary. You have your classic, which generally the men have that. It's, it's very in the center of the chest. feels like something's sitting on them. They usually refer to an elephant that's sitting on them. Women are a bit different. While they can have those classic signs, they tend to have some odd signs, some atypical signs, such as nausea, excessive fatigue, maybe some back pain, jaw pain. Pretty much 50% of people will ignore those signs and symptoms. They'll just think, oh, well, this is... I'm stressed, I don't, I don't need to go to the doctor. It's your body's way of saying something's wrong. So we don't ignore the signs. Be beyond the three events, the signature events, the ball, the Go Red Luncheon and the walk, we have many different events throughout the year where we go out and educate people. The more we talk, the more we, we learn um, from each other about um, ways that we can be healthier. So the American Heart Association touches all ages and um, really makes an impact when it comes to saving lives.